feet, 10 inches tall, and weighed in officially at 156.2 pounds, fighting with the House of Champions from Reseda, California, Darian DC Chapman. Man in charge of the action, Mike Bell. The University of MMA means to me uh, be, being able to be on the stage that allows me to display my skills at a place where it feels like a UFC event. Um, it doesn't look like some of the other promotions that I have seen that I've been willing to go to, um, but I haven't had the chance to go to them due to the fact that I had a brand new son born. But the University of MMA means to me just honestly allowing me to display my skills uh, and actually the town that I originally grew up in, which is Los Angeles. Uh, the way that that pretty much started was uh, one day, me and my fiance were at the movies, uh, and I, there was a guy. There was one guy about to fight, about 12 other guys. And before the fight started, uh, I tried to go over there and stop the fight because it just looked unfair. So as I was walking over there, the fight already started, broke out. I tried to pull one of the guys off of off of the guy they were fighting, and eventually I ended up fighting three people at one time. Uh, from that fight, I think I only got hit one. I think I only got hit one time, and my fiance was just sitting back watching the fight. So as I was hurling through the chairs, I was making sure that I had a one-on-one -on -one or at least a two-on-one -on -one throughout the fight. And uh, from there, my fiance saw me fight. Uh, she saw that, you know, that I really didn't get hurt and asked me, why am I not fighting? I explained to her I don't have money to go to, to the gym and she gave me a hundred bucks and boom, that's how I started to end up at uh, House of Champions. So I used to walk around at 176. Now I'm averaging walking around at 160. I'm in between 160 and 165 every day. Um, outside of that, uh, I think uh, my willingness to fight in the streets is just, it's really went down. Um, I'm not really trying to go out there and save anybody or anything like that because right now, number one thing that I'm thinking about is my family and myself and make sure that I don't get hurt. Uh, the first technique that I really loved, I can't really say that I had one that I really loved because I started off with judicious and it's it something I didn't like at all. Um, but once I got uh, used to it and I started to get a little better, my favorite move was the Kimura. And then once I learned how to use my legs, my favorite move became the triangle. Heavy blows from above by DC Chapman. Honestly, the guy that I wanted to fight when I uh, first uh, watched this event, I wanted to fight Jacoby Powell. So I wanted to fight somebody that uh, actually seems like they have a fire under them. He seems like he has that fire up under him. Just plain and simple, uh, I want to go out there and face the toughest guys. And so far at the 155, um, somebody that has knockout power like that, you want to get your, ten your chin tested as early as possible, especially if you want to uh, consider going pro. And there goes Chapman for an arm bar. That looks pretty deep. He's really torquing it, and that's the fight. Darian DC Chapman. Out of the blue corner, Darian DC Chapman. Um, since I'm a dancer first, uh, I used to do crump dancing. Uh, if you guys don't know what that is, it's an urban style of hip hop dancing. And then I converged it over with my style of pop locking. Uh, so, if anything, I, I think the, the fast hand movement that you guys will see if you were to go check out any Crump videos is what I bring to the table. Um, I have fast hands, I'm fast on my feet, I got amazing balance, um, and just on top of that, uh, I got the spirit and the will to go out there and fight no matter who I'm fighting. Another one right there.